Hey guys, so in this video, we are basically going to talk about the questions that have been asked on today's DCA's uh, assessment organized by CCS. So let's read the question first, and that is, consider one string as input, and you have to check whether the string obtained from the input string with single backward and single forward shift are the same or not. If they are the same, then print one, otherwise print zero. So here you can basically see that forward shift means a single circular rotation of the string in which the last character becomes the first character and uh, the other characters are shifted to the right. For example, you can see here that uh, this is my main string and after a forward shift, the last character that is O, it becomes the first character and the uh, other characters shifted by one in the right hand side. And for the backward shift, a single circular rotation of the string in which the first character becomes the last character you can see that the first character is uh, h that becomes the last in the modified string after a backward shift and the other characters are shifted one index to its left so we understood the main point now it's very simple code first we have to take user input for this we follow our syntax and our next task is to make those modified strings so for the forward string i will do um string of minus one minus one means the last character the the character that is uh that is there in the last index plus string of zero to one sorry zero to minus one Okay, so this is for the backward and uh, this was for forward and now this is for the backward and for the backward is string 1 plus typo string of 0 you can see that string of 1 colon means from this from 1 to the last this is in first position and the zeroth element that is h it is now the last element now we have created those modified strings now it's time to check if both are same or not now if forward equals equals backward then print one otherwise print zero now I will check this code with the sample test cases the, uh, that were provided in the question. So let's run my program. Now it's asking for a string. Okay, so I'm um, giving the first string that is F F D L and then OP. It, it, it has not any meaning, it's a random string. Now you can see that it returns zero. Now we will check for sample test case two. Suppose my string is M A M A, and if we see that it returned one, that means if we if we perform a forward shift or a backward shift in both cases, the values will be same. That's why it returned one. 